Hey, this is Colton with Central Alps out of Arlington. We're the premier off-road custom shop in the DFW area, if you didn't know us already. Today, we built this 1986 Jeep CJ. If you were wondering if you could install this from your home driveway, in fact, you can. Here are my few tips and tricks when installing this four inch rough country kit. A, it is not your normal lift kit. This lift kit actually includes four leaf springs. It's gonna be a leaf spring kit and that's pretty much how it lifts four inches in case you were wondering. So when you're doing this from your home driveway, you're going to want to use a transmission jack or a car jack to prop up the differential. While this is happening, you only wanna take one leaf spring off at a time, or we could put two transmission jacks to prop up the differential from two different sides. That way you can remove both leaf springs at the same time. It's a little bit riskier, but it will save you time in the long run kind of just depends on how much risk you're willing to take. The back of this vehicle is gonna be set up the same. You have four wheel drive and you've got two differentials. So here in the back, you're obviously gonna have your other two leaf springs that you will install the same way as the front, as I mentioned before. You're gonna be tempted to tighten this bolt on the leaf spring all the way. Do not do it. It's gonna make your life 10 times easier when you're installing this kit. Once the vehicle's back on the ground with the tires and wheels already torqued, then you can go back and tighten this bolt all the way down. That way you don't have any loose screws. This bolt right here is actually the same, same idea. You don't want to tighten it right away, but once the Jeep is back on the ground, you can go ahead and tighten it. If you have any questions or want your Jeep to look like this, you can go watch our walkthrough video where I talk about exactly what we did to this Jeep in terms of the brand of the lift kit or maybe the brand of the tires. Also, if you have any questions on did these tire and wheels fit on this Jeep, you can go watch our Will It Fit video and see that they in fact did. That's all I have. If you have any more questions, you can get with one of our design consultants today and reach us at 833-268-2577 and we'll be right with you.